Why, hello there. I'm here with a new series again in CK2 The Jade Dragon. I think this is 2.8, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 2.8, this is right there. And uh, here we are going to be doing an achievement run for an achievement that I have seen no one even attempt so far, at least on YouTube. And that is going to be the White Hunt achievement. And it says right here, starting as the last remnant of the White Huns, Count of Moha Dava Saka in 769, restored the borders of the Ephelite Empire. Ephelite, Ephelite. I don't know what that sound was. Is everything okay with my computer? I hope so. And uh, that man is located right here. We are an Iranian people. We are Saka culture. I don't know if there's going to be anyone else. We are going to set all that to default. Mm-hmm. Yep. Reset rules and um. Oh. Yep. And let's go. Uh, white hun. We can delete that. I just started to see what it looked like, and uh, I guess I'll name this one white hun. White hun. Bam. So we have our obvious first goal. Pretty much the entire empire is going to be all this area right around here. Actually, it's everything that encompasses the Bengal, the, yeah, the Empire of Rajasthan. Mostly everything. I don't think this right here is needed, but that doesn't matter. If I end up missing a couple of provinces, then I'll just go and fix it. And uh, go check the achievement. Because I think it says... Okay. Well, at least um, there was a dev log. Yeah, the dev uh, little development log, development blog thingy uh, says these specific places. So if I need to find those out, uh, I will. But for now, we just need to expand. And right now, do I need to go to war or do I need? I'm just gonna do that. We have a son. Uh, me. Just gonna name him me. He's gonna be learning the struggle. And could become the king of Gujarat. But how much money do I make? One dollar a month. That is pretty good. So what do I want to go for? I think I want to go for that. Because first I need to switch to this mode. And ooh, we do not have anyone weak near us. And it just goes us, then the king. Which is all of this. So is that... Okay, that guy's independent, him. So in order for me to fight anybody, I'm probably going to have to hire some mercs, which I need to know. Uh, you are getting fired. Uh, you can stay. Okay, so I only needed to fire one person. I'll hire you and just give me a claim on that right there. So this starting situation is not the greatest. Anyone here have a daughter? No daughter. No daughter. No daughter. This may be the person that I have the best chance of trying to get a claim on. And actually beating. But we may have to just go after this guy. Who has no vassals? Just him. Okay, never mind. Let's go after this guy. I didn't realize he had three provinces. You! You, buddy. You are the one we're going after. Yeah, we are very weak. So uh, here at the start, we need to just make sure we don't die. And... I'll just become exalted among men. And I need to get married anyway. And... You. Okay, you're so far away. It doesn't even matter. Um... Whatever, we'll just marry some person. Anyone... Oh man, Slim Pickens. Slim Pickens. So let's marry you. Okay. Yep. Give me that money. That audio is really loud. There we go. Um, so you were just granted some land. You, buddy. But I can't go after you. Because you're too far away. I think I'm gonna have to just wait till I get the claim. Uh, 
So I need to go see our laws. What are the laws for the land? A gavelkin off of obviously just absolute garbage. We do not want that. We're going to want to get primogeniture as soon as possible. Um, that's not where we want to look. Council. So he has absolute power. Awesome. And um, here in the game, it's good for your liege to have absolute power so he cannot um, screw us over with enforcing peace. So let's just go ahead and... Oh yeah, and on top of everything, I'm just playing on very hard because why not? Got nothing else to do. So everyone we fight are going to be really strong and we're going to have huge minuses. Because um, I just maybe, you know, need a little bit of an extra challenge because this series... You know, I'd want it to not be too easy because this game can kind of snowball out of control. And uh, all we have to do is a start. So it's not like there's any crazy, uh, you know, requirements that we have to stay of a certain religion. All we have to do is keep our culture. Or we don't even need to keep our culture. Which I'd like to just because it seems like it'd be fun that way. Um, or religion. So right now we're Hindu. News from China. Son, oh man. The Emperor died, and it's him, Lee. They are, right now, they're in unrest. Okay, so there's no open civil war against them. He frowns upon the Bon religion. Do I get anything for you? No. Uh, I could send you a commander. Why not have the commander, and I'll send you a eunuch. Look at that. Why not? Have the eunuch. There you go. You can get some OP stuff from that guy. So we're just going to build our points ahead of time. So we don't have to wait for the cooldown. Um, collect taxes. Yeah. Oh yeah, you just, we just sent that guy off. Uh, anyone else? You! Yes. There we go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. take it so we're not making much money that is very disappointing um, I don't think there's anything to do. our liege is in a holy war that's cool don't care about that hmm there really isn't anything you can do in this game this early in this situation because we're just a one province man Yeah, I mean, everyone around us can have more men than us. Counselor positions. Choose a patron deity. Um, get the martial man. Get Sheba. Or actually, I think Sheba's a girl. Search for a smith. Doesn't matter. Don't care. Any of those? No. I'm not spending any money on that crap. Ooh, Buddy, okay. If I could get both claims, I'll just, you know, get money from the Jews and declare war on him. And take him down. Uh, our liege, okay, so he's at max, so that's why he gave away that land. That's good. Um, do I want to be Marshal? No, thank you. I just need to make sure he doesn't try to revoke. Oh, wait, hey, we're good. Okay. Awesome. So he won't revoke land from me because we're the same religion. That's awesome. I'll take it. Because that can be a big, big problem in this game sometimes. Is if you're not the same religion as your liege, they will religiously revoke all of your land when you're not even suspecting it. And you'll just end up at war sometimes. So that's good. I don't really care what my council thinks. Um, why not just court tutor? Anyone with good enough marshal? No. Wait, that guy has some insane... Oh, man, look at this guy. Whoa, his... Look at his stats went up so high. 
can't do any of that. Hmm. Ooh. Oh, wait, I'm fighting? I'm leading troops? Oh, man. Change religious branch. Could do that. But I'm gonna stay the same as Malige. Oh, we can get concubines in this culture. Or religion, I mean. Uh, so I'm just gonna leave the life. Um, here we go. Resign as commander. Sorry, buddy. But I'm just not about that life. Like, you just lost a hand. I don't want to lose my hand. I got my trait and I'm getting out. Um, could change religious branch. I think I'm fine with what I got, though. Yeah, we got the arbitrary stat. Whatever. That's who we are. Boom. Okay. So, I got that. I'm lower on men. But... One thing you can get in this game is that Imperial Marriage right there. If I could ever get a thousand grace. That'd be amazing. But it will take a long, 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 long time before I can get that much. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Let's check the mercenaries. Uh, what are the best ones I can get? Eh, I think these guys are good. This guy has money. But I think I can beat him. Oh, I can borrow money from the Jews, can I? I can't, because of our religion. Oh, we don't have any Jews available. I forgot about that. Dang it. Okay. Well, come home. Dang it. There's nothing I can really do right now. Because I can't afford to hire mercs. So we're just standing around doing nothing. It's going to be our life. The, oh wait, I have an on oh, no, muted. Oops. Armadi, we got a daughter, which is awesome. Because that means if I go to you, you don't have a daughter. You have a daughter. If we betroth the marriage between them, a matrilineal marriage, uh. Oh yeah. What about what about your second daughter? How about that? How about her? No. Okay. You apparently are in war. You have kids. What is that happening? I hear that noise. Is the window okay? Honestly, don't know what's going on, my computer. What is happening? I may have to just restart it after this video. Um, so you are just a girl. Uh, I could take a concubine from you. No. You won't want to get married. You have a daughter. How many men? You only got that much. You don't really have anything to offer me. Crud. I need this guy to have... Is he a different religion? Okay. How about this? Betrothed the marriage. Matrilineal. We'll break it later. Real quick. I want to get me a de bon. Because I can change my elect. Yeah. There we go. No vassal has a negative opinion of me. What do you... Here. Why can I not um, appoint canceller? Okay. Honorary title. Why? 
Okay, that's ten more. I really don't want to make my kid a sacrificial lamb, though. Because I'm already giving him a betrothal. But we'll break that. Right? You'll get the alliance. If I send you the money... Oh, man, I could send him all my money and he could just say no. Action, second thought. We have to break the betrothal. I don't want to risk spending money on that. Um, crap, you probably have kids, don't you? No? You don't. How about you? Are you weak? You're weak. Okay. Get me a claim on that land right there. Arrange a betrothal between them. There we go. A much better alliance. There we go. And you'll actually accept it. Uh, don't care. Boom. So we have an ally now. We probably can't beat that guy just uh, between the two of us. Yeah, there's no smaller mercs. I can... Still can't afford them. What if I go here go to all and let's see if there's anyone no that dude's a Han guy I don't know how he got here um, but why not let's get Sen come join the squad mm -hmm. there we go bam and I can get one more uh, de bon. Is there anyone? You got any concubines for me, buddy? Anyone got any? Got some ladies. There we go. Woo! Got a concubine from that guy. Still have the vassal who hates me. And I can't appoint him. Did I knock you off the council? I wonder. I probably did. Yep, fired him from the council. Oops. So we have to wait until I can reappoint him. I was uh, not paying attention when I knocked him off. But uh, he'll be back. Soon enough. Okay. Can I just... No, you'll hate me in turn. Um, there you go. This is a job for you. Just don't do anything. And we can go to Elective Gavelkind. Uh, if needed... Yeah, let's we'll switch to that. Why not? I'm going to hold all the land, so it's not really that big of a deal. Don't have to worry about other electors at the moment. And we're just moving on. It's probably going to be in the second episode when we go attack someone. Particularly this guy. He's going to go down. Just a matter of time and saving up money. Because he makes more money. Way more money than I do. Mm -hmm. He's probably investing his money in upgrading his lands. Yep, he is. Oh my god. Well, we're going to take the shorter route and we're just going to take his lands from him. Once this civil war is over, or... Oh my god, my chancellor left. What a dick. Now I have nobody. I got nobody to be chancellor. Anybody even remotely decent at that job? Nope. Well, that guy got us our claims, and then he immediately left, so... That's how that went. Still convinced I can beat this guy. I have I have a daughter still, so I can use her as marriage bait. You have a second kingdom, is it Gavelkind? <gasps> Please have a son. Oh man, that'll split it all up. Uh wait a second. Wait a second. 
Uh, no thank you. Uh, good luck in your war. I'm not gonna go join you in your suicide mission. It's just not gonna work out. So, we have to wait till this is over. Okay, the future is looking good. I got a game plan. All mapped out. We have two daughters. We're unmarried. Um, I'd be fine with stressed. I could get him brave. Ooh, yeah, get him brave. There you go, and he's ambitious. Shaping up to be good. Now we just have to wait for this to be over. Still getting our money, so I'm gonna be able to invade this guy with all that fat stacks of cash. Sham. There we go, that's a much easier name to read. So we got our son, Sham. News, okay. A great Mongol horde. Oh. Look at that. Mongol invasion. Oh. Dang. Oh, of course we'll go. No, I'd love to be able to give him more stuff. Okay. And field hunt. So I'm the end up. I'm going to end the episode there. We have money and we need to invade someone, but we need to have. I think I can safely invade this guy right here. We just we're gonna have the problem of morale. Our morale is just absolute garbage. So I probably should have tried to get a claim on this guy, but I have nobody. Nobody exists that wants to join us. Nobody likes us. Is this guy with eight? He has 17, Marshall. Ooh. Okay, so you died. Wait a second. Oh, they're under her. But she's not really all that weak. But I could. My karma's not high enough. Because I'm lustful. Okay. But I'll worry about that later. Until for now, if you liked the video, you can leave a like. If you want to see more, you can subscribe and stay tuned till next time when we start our glorious invasion of our enemies and we destroy them and bury them into the ground.